I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. Corey. Corey, no. what are you doing? No, I'm going to do it. Stop it. Stop. Wait, what are you doing? Get that gun. Get that gun out of your head. What are you doing? Why did you take it from me? What? You crazy? I was going to do it. This Corey. Way. This movie just sucked the soul right out of me. Be a man, you little bitch. Come on, Corey. Hey, wait a minute. When could you shoot electric shocks? Hey, that's like some R2-D2 shit you pull. What is that? There's a lot of things I can do that you'll never know of. Oh, man. Yeah, well, uh, one of the things you can apparently do is withstand these movies better than I could. Man, I, I, I know that you like to download this stuff and you never like to leave this room, but I had to just bring you to the theater with me. I couldn't do it alone. I yeah. just had to I just had to be there for your reaction. It, You've never seen one of these movies before. I know, Corey. And, and you about to blow your head. Ain't You ain't doing me no damn favors. You, you think you're going to leave me behind? Are you crazy? <laughs> Screw you, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Tortured me by dragging me to this shit turd of a film. You you wanted to be whole. You did not believe me. I told you before you came with me. I said, you have not seen the horrors that I have seen, co-host. Corey, I avoid these movies for a reason. It's like if you were to ask me to watch a, a, a some porno with a, with a donkey and a midget. I just have no business watching that, but, Corey. And I will not... I will not stand by and let you show that to me. Wait a minute. Don't you have that in your collection? <laughs> hey, you don't have to tell everybody about that. <laughs> but even that cannot touch the, uh, the, 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 atrocities? the atrocities. Yes, <laughs> thank you. The atrocities of this film. We're a disaster movie, man. Oh, I, I'll, I'll call it a, a shitty movie. How's that, Corey? Oh, oh, oh man. Let me, let me call say. it what it is. Oh, you know something? Each one of these movies... They've been known to just be parodies. I mean, they they oh, really? kind of have they, they kind of have somewhat a, a a thread of a plot, but most of it is just referring to whatever movie is popular at the time. And they keep getting worse with every film. Well, damn you, Corey! This is the first one I've seen, and oh my god, I, are you trying to tell me the other ones were masterpieces compared to this? I want these motherfuckers. Jason Friedberg and Aaron Seltzer, I want their goddamn heads on my table tomorrow morning. Oh, my God. at the neck, blood cleaned up, and a plate delivered to me. These sons of bitches should not be allowed to make anything. They should not be allowed near a camera. You know how they say sexual predators are not allowed around kids? Uh... No. Okay, well, I, I don't know by experience, but they are. I want them to have a restraining order against video cameras, digital photography cameras, 35 millimeter Super 8. Holy I, I don't cats. want them. To, I want the kitchen them, sink, too? Get, get them away from it. I want them a Fisher Price toy camera. I don't want them near it. <laughs> oh my God. These motherfuckers, man. Well, these Corey, I'll tell you what, brother. You know what? You, you know in the Harry Potter movies when they tell you they're going to transport you to a world of magic? <laughs> I felt like this movie just transported me to a world of shit. What the hell? Let, who, oh. who? I mean, how did these guys become filmmakers? I mean, honestly, I've seen better short films on YouTube with, with some kind of coherence and, and, a, and a plot sometimes, I, Corey. I'm, they, they got pictures of... Wait. Sorry, Popkin. They got pictures of these guys up on the internet. Look, there they are right there. They're, they're, now, we see two grown men. That yeah. is a ruse. That is yeah. not real. It is, I swear to you, it is two 13 year old mentally challenged kids <laughs> somebody <laughs> gave a camera to and let them make, and let them go out and shoot something. I thought they were paper mache dummies. I'm sorry. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> these, uh, oh, man. Look, people, let me tell you, you want another plot of this movie? Disaster movie. You want another plot of it? You want another tell plot? Him, yeah. Tell them, Corey, because I'm trying to figure it out still. I can tell you real quick, the whole thing is a parody of Cloverfield. The world is being, is being plagued by these disasters, uh, yeah. earthquakes, tornadoes, Bullshit. Uh, uh, yes. storms. And the only way to stop it, now get this, the only way to stop it is to return the crystal skull back on his altar. You, 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 you get Corey, it? I, I'm, you, I'm surprised you found, you found somewhat of a plot in here. I, I mean, man, this, this, this movie was shot in, in shittoscope. I mean, with the shitty script. I mean, I, the first five minutes of this movie, 
I, I felt like a baboon was raping my goddamn head, Corey. I mean, really. Don't you use that word script with this movie. They have the nerve. They have the audacity <laughs> to sit up there and put written by in the credits. <laughs> nobody wrote this shit. You know what they did? They went on IMDb. They, yeah. looked, they went to uh, Quick Time Trailers. Yep. And they just waited to see what movies would be popular. And they dressed up in the funny costumes of those movies, ranging from Iron Man, The Hulk, Batman, Hellboy, Wanted. Alvin the Chipmunks are crying Chip out loud. Kung Fu Panda, Beowulf. Love Guru, the, another shitty film. A movie that wasn't even a hit. No. Just, that just goes to show you that they were just not even looking to see what it was going to be. They just said, oh, Love Guru has Mike Myers in it. That's possibly going to be a hit. We got to make that into our movie. And you know what's even more tragic? When you make a 30-minute a, a, a segment all about High School Musical. It's, what? You, what? Well, that's the thing, man. The beginning of this movie. Is that even a movie? It, <laughs> no. You, the first 30 minutes of this movie, there's, there's not even a story happening. It, they, the, the first 30 minutes of this movie, they just say, hey, it's American Gladiators. Oh, hey, it's 10,000 B.C. Oh, wait, wait a minute. Look, it's, uh, 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 what, what's that chick's name? Uh, Amy Winehouse? No, uh, yeah, what well, they doing? Look, it's Amy Winehouse. I thought Amy Winehouse edited and directed this film after watching it, <laughs> Corey, honestly. With her teeth. <laughs> yeah. And then, and, and then uh, Carmen, oh, look, it's Carmen Electra playing. Oh, my God. You talk, okay. I, I, wait, I, what, I, what's her name from, uh, 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 from 1A? What, uh, what, what, what? what? Uh, what's the chick that, uh, Kate, oh, uh, it, look, it's, uh, it's, it, it, it's, uh, 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 Kim Kardashian? No, no, no. What's that? God damn it. This movie got me some... <laughs> uh, what's that girl? Uh, it's Carmen Electra. Yeah. She's Angelina Jolie from what? I mean, they were just... Oh, and that's yeah, what they yeah. do. They, they introduce the joke and then they... they and just in case you didn't get yeah. it... And they don't introduce it, Corey. Now, now, be careful with your words here because they don't introduce God, a goddamn thing. They just... It just pops up on the screen and you're like, D -d did I miss something? What? Huh? <laughs> oh, yeah. Am I no. on... Am, am I on PCP right now? What yeah, the? it's like it's, it's like they're looking at something. It's like, oh look, it's Juna. And, you know, hey, get it, Juna. I mean, yeah. oh my God, you see, man. So you see, you see somebody bend down to tie their shoes, and and, and they and they rise up, and, and they're in the middle of ten thousand BC. I I'm sorry, I don't I don't get it. I it, not, it doesn't make any sense. I mean, the first five minutes of the movie, uh, a guy falls into a pile of shit, and then he uh, fights an American gladiator. That where is exactly the, how it plays where out. In the that's exactly what Where does an American Gladiator, where, how does that fit into this, does that, I mean, how does that fit into a parody? <laughs> Man, Come on. Come, why are we trying to figure this out, Corey? Why? Am I paid to do this? I don't understand, Corey. Help more, me understand. The more I talk about this, the more I can't take it. Oh, no my more. God, Corey. Just calm down. Calm down, Corey. And Corey, Corey, are you watching the end of this movie? I'm like, is, is, is this whole movie working itself to, to introduce Indian uh, black midget? These uh, look, I got to almost give them, I almost got to give them respect for having the balls to do this. You want to know how much sense this movie makes? Out of nowhere, at the end of the movie, we get a black midget coming out dressed like Indiana Jones, telling the main character, "I'm your father." I'm your father. <laughs> that's, that's the plot. That's the that's the whole summary of the movie. The I, whole the whole movie worked its uh, worked its way up, or, or should I say, down to that. Co-host, let me tell you something. Tell I, me, Corey. I swear to you, this is the truth. Before I came to this movie, before I got in the car to drive to the theater, before we loaded up to go. You said, you know what, I, be I better bring co along that sorry son of a bitch. And have him suffer with me. No, I, what I did was I drank. I beat myself silly. I touched substances that I would never even imagine doing before or ever again just to prepare for this movie. And it didn't help at all. Damn, Corey. <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. You might as well just let the dog next door rape you, I guess. It would have been, it would have been more entertaining than what I just saw tonight. <laughs> Hell oh. yeah! If I would have filmed that shit, now that's a movie. Wait, let me say, it would have been more entertaining than what I saw tonight. You are correct, sir. <laughs> I ought to film that shit, and that'll be a movie. Yeah, it'd be better. It'd be better, big, bigger blockbuster than you can expect with this piece of garbage. Oh my God! I. Let me, God has nothing to do with this, Corey. After watching this movie, there is no God. There is no... no what's that you said? No, no God. No God. <laughs>
and, it's, and it's so funny because you and I are sitting in the theater. I mean, yeah. it, before the reaction is like you expect it to be. We're sitting yeah. there like, oh, oh, this is terrible. <laughs> oh, and then about 40 minutes into it, halfway through, we're just sitting up there just laughing because we are losing our yeah, minds. We have, we have, we, it's we, a madhouse. A madhouse. A madhouse. We're delusional. I'm in a zoo. <laughs> Oh my God! I, people, what can I tell you about this point yeah. that you that we haven't told you before? I mean, they they take a couple of hot girls that are that are kind of the it girls that I you guess, yeah. that, that used to be are now. Mm -hmm. For example, uh, Kim Kardashian is in this. Yeah. yeah, I mean, what else has she got to do? A Porn. <laughs> she's, exactly. she's, you know, stick to what you know. Porn. All right, just and, do that. And then Carmen Electra. I mean, this is her career. Doing oh. these shitty parody movies. Oh, boy. I, I can never look at Carmen Electra ever again after this goddamn movie. And you know what's sad is that there's a, there's a wrestling scene in this movie, and, and somehow these filmmakers managed to fuck that up. You don't, you don't, you get close ups of like a, an ear and some hair. You, there's tits and ass falling and flipping all over the place. And you don't get any kind of close-ups or nothing of any of that action. Yeah, yeah you, you expected that. Okay, at least in this kind of movie, you expecting to get, all right, at least you got Kim Kardashian and Carmen Electra yeah. and they're wrestling with you. Yeah. Okay, they're going to do a close-up on the ass and on the yeah. breast. No, you're right. We got an ear. Yeah, what do I get? I, 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 get, I, get, the, get, I get boots and, 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 a, and a goddamn nose. I don't get it. I was like, wait, wait did they hand that, that black Indiana Jones midget a camera and let him <laughs> film that shit? Was that part of the contract, Corey? Did anybody have a contract to begin with? And in case you're wondering, you're probably saying to yourself, you haven't, if you don't know by now, if you haven't, you haven't been, you haven't been listening to us long enough. Uh, Jason Friedberg and Aaron Seltzer, they are the guys responsible for date movie, oh, epic movie, Meet the Spartans, and now this piece of shit. Yeah, I mean, just dude, just call the, the series what it is. Shit movies. I mean, that just call it that, please. And, Save the yeah. public some despair and just call it what it goddamn is. Yeah, shit movie part one. Shit movie part two. Shit movie part three. Shit, shit movie part, yeah, shoot, shit movie part four, the, the search for more shit. Uh, <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, my God. Man, let me tell you something. I, and, and I said it here right now with you as my witness. If you sons of bitches out there make this movie number one, I am going to strip down to my bare ass and set myself on fire. Because oh you God. will make it a hit, and I cannot suffer through anything like this oh ever God. again. Oh, oh man. I, you know what? You people out, out there, you want to, you say, hey, Corey, is there a movie worse than bullshit? What would that rating be? <laughs> you know what? I have seen a movie worse than bullshit. How about this for a rating worse than bullshit? How about a resounding fuck you? <laughs> Holy you God. Sons of bitches. Language, Corey. The kids. Think sorry, about the kids. I can't help it. I'm no, sorry. No, you're right, I, man. man. This, this, this movie needs to go, go, go fuck itself and, and, uh, oh. I, I can't even think anymore, Corey. I can't even think. <laughs> it's, it, I, it felt like part of my, my, my the microchips in my head just fell on the floor and, and, some, and a monkey just peed on him. I don't, I don't understand, Corey. <laughs> I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. Where am I? Who am I? All right, and all this ranting, I guess I should try to give like a serious analysis of this movie. Oh, uh, God, no, I mean, I'm not going to give a serious <laughs> analogy of it, but I mean, really, seriously, what's wrong with these movies is that, and we, what can we say that we haven't said before? Each movie uh, is, is a series of parodies, and they're not even clever parodies. It really is as if someone just looked at the trailers for movies that they thought were going to be blockbusters, and they just referenced them. And there is no, I have really, and they get worse with every movie. And I am awestruck. I am baffled at what I've seen with this movie because they pretty much just said, you know what? We do not need a script. We are just going to make one parody, one lame, retarded parody after another. And that's it. I mean, that's some things that could even work in here. Like those chipmunks. I mean, they kind of made me laugh because they just hey, look so crazy. I was laughing because they look so crazy. Yeah, they, they were fake as hell. Yeah. They, they look like they, they look like they're having a stroke while they were on the camera. Yeah, they had little, little arms. arms that were just shaking just for no reason. Yeah. I mean, there's something funny about when, the, when uh, characters have been done in CG and these mm -hmm. guys don't attempt to even do that. <laughs> and then they even do that with Kung Fu Panda. It's a guy mm -hmm. and a lame-ass Kung exactly. Fu Panda. Exactly. And that could be hilarious, but they don't know how to... They don't know how to tell a joke, and they don't know how to end a scene. They don't scene. know how to end it. And, and, the, and the other sad fact is that these guys are, like, ripping off a lot of the jokes that you saw at the beginning of the movie where I'm like, wow, they just really 
rip themselves off just yeah. now with a terrible joke. <laughs> yeah. Anytime you start out by having to explain to the people what the joke is, look, it's Iron Man. Uh, it, then why? Mm, I mean, yeah. you should be the, the joke should be smart enough, and the audience should be smart enough yeah. to know how to get it. They, they shouldn't be spoon fed that. So yeah, no, this movie is, this movie's awful. Okay, so now that I've done that, co-host, I'm gonna ask that you just do one thing for me. Uh, what's that? Hold me. Hey, get off me, man! <laughs> this, this night's already been a nightmare. No need to add on to the experience. I feel no pain anymore. You'll see it in the animation, people. <laughs> if you listen to the audio, you'll know what we're talking about. <laughs> Animated terror. <laughs> Horror. Horror. <laughs> Horror. <laughs> okay, we're just being silly now. What did you say? <laughs> Rosebud. <laughs> oh, people, come on. You got to give us a break. I, I mean, yes. we, you, we, we're yeah. just being silly because if you see what we, we had, yeah. what we just saw, you just be, you'd be re- just silly as we are. <laughs> I, felt like, I just <laughs> I felt like I had Indiana Black Jones just... <laughs> Indiana Black Jones midget just just rape my head. I, I let him rape my head, and, and I also let him take pictures of it. It's that same black midget too. That it's that one poor bastard. It's like there's one black midget out yeah. there, and that's him. It's like, do they pull him out of the asylum or something? They just throw. Him. Hey, it's like what no the one. hell's going on? Oh, you got a sweet ass. Oh, I'm your father. What? It's like no other black midget can get into work until that son of a bitch is dead. That, that guy must be CG because he never ages, man. Did you notice that? I'm like, this guy This guy just never ages. When you're like four feet tall, you can never tell. I mean, you know, it was funny because there's a scene. This where you shake it, where the, the, the ground shaking. People, the, re- the review is over. We're just going on because yeah. we just we just want to be silly right now. I mean, there's a scene where the ground is shaking and everybody's like kind of stumbling. And he's so short, he's standing still. Looks like, looks like he's wading through water or something. Just like looking down like, whoa. I'm yeah. acting. <laughs> oh man, no, it's uh, oh, we uh, uh, it's we career, we career are, suicide. We are we are yeah, being in right these now. movies is career suicide. I don't yeah, know why, why would anybody yeah. do that? What at this point in time? Yeah. I mean, I know the movies go number one, right. A lot of times. Mm-hmm. I mean, Meet the Spartans did. I think Epic Movie did, and yeah. those movies were number one because th- it was strategic. Uh, it was strategy on the on the studios part. Mm-hmm. They released those movies when. They had nothing to go against. Yeah, and that's there was, true. And they were PG thirteen, yeah. and so kids go see them. So and, I understand and, and, why they do well, yeah. but there's no excuse anymore. No, 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 no. I, honestly, when we went to go see it, I was expecting people there with tomatoes to start, you know, to start pelting us because we didn't know any better. <laughs> I mean, even the guy taking the tickets was like, I could tell, like in in, in the back of his head, he was like, "You shitheads." <laughs> Yeah, cause we, cause we, see, we went to a midnight uh, movie, uh, a screening of this, and it wasn't really a screening. They just happened to have a paid screening at midnight, so we wanted to record this before Friday. And yeah, we, we were the only dumbasses in there. I think there was like one guy. Way no, you up know the what? Top. There was like, I think there were like eight people. No, 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 no. You're exaggerating. That, no, that couldn't have been. Did you look, really? Yeah, because people kind of came in after we after we were already in there. Like there oh. was one. It was there were like four people or two people in the back. No, there were two, two people. Yeah, there, there were two, two people, people in the back. Came in, yeah. And then two people strolled in before the movie started. Okay. And then there were those two teenagers that yeah. sat down in front. Yeah, you know <laughs> those teenagers. Those guys scared the shit out of me because as soon as they came in, as soon as they sat down, I heard one of them go, <laughs> and it was a scene where they were looking at a calendar, and I'm like, oh shit, these guys are these guys are fucked up. Yo, yeah. <laughs> You know I'm laughing throughout the whole movie. It's and they be didn't and torture. They didn't, oh yeah, and they didn't laugh anymore. You no, no, no. That was it. You just yeah. heard those two guys go. They sat down. And as soon as they sat down with their popcorn, they were prepared. Boy, they had their popcorn and their coke. They're like, <laughs> and I was like, I just looked at them like, you sons of you bitches, punk asses, man. man. You but you know what? You know who probably thought were the most retarded people in there. Yeah. You and me. Well, I know. Like, first of all, who's that guy with that little metal ball with it? <laughs> and then, they, but we were in there like we weren't laughing at the movie. Yeah. Really, we were just making ourselves laugh because yeah, we were just because we were we were delirious. We were we were delirious. Yeah, it, it, it was like being drunk and, and and it's like eight in the morning and you're still shit faced drunk <laughs> and you just don't know what to do. You're not tired. You just you're in some kind of screwed up coma altered state. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how you describe it. it. No, it was insane, man. So, yeah, we. I think even though we were the ones that probably hated it the uh-huh. most in the theater, uh, I yeah. think we were the ones that probably looked like the biggest dumbasses. Yeah. I think we, we were, were talking. I think we were we were laughing at our own jokes. And everyone, we everyone, was, so everyone was looking at us like, those shitheads. Yeah, look at those <laughs> assholes down there. I mean, because we, were, we, we would just say anything and just laugh. Exactly. It's like, look at that fool. <laughs> I know. And we were laughing at shit in the background. <laughs> like, we were laughing at extras. There was like an old black guy with a cane just... <laughs> 
in the background just walking. Oh. And you could tell that guy was putting his all into it. He's like, I'm getting, I'm getting really paid for this. You know? Yeah, we that scene while those actors were like hurt and walking by. Yeah, that was like the funniest thing to us because we were like, look at this guy. He's, like, he's walking along like he's crippled. He ain't crippled. He can't fool me. I will tell you what, though. I, I laughed my ass off during that one scene, the breakdance scene or whatever. The Oh, the <laughs> step up two. It. Yeah, when that chick starts dancing and she just punches that black guy for no reason. <laughs> You know the, 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 the worst Benny Hill fake punch ever. <laughs> and that, 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 worst, that really bad sound effect. <laughs> <laughs> like she didn't hardly even touch him. It's like, <laughs> yeah, she just went crazy. I, I heard, yeah, I was sitting there with you. I heard you laughing hard at that, too. Man. I was like, I, what? Oh, I laughed at that, and I laughed at the scene where the black dude, when he's dancing, he, he puts his shirt over his head, <laughs> and he starts convulsing for no reason. Now, hey, now that was funny, all right? But see, that wasn't even really meant to be funny. No, they, that was had, by accident. They got a dance number in this movie where it's not, it, it's, it's not even meant for laughs. It, it no. is actually like Step Up. It's yeah, a dance it sequence. <laughs> yeah. And they might have a little uh, 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 sight gag here and there, but yeah. they, they're really dancing. Every, yeah, they, they were really and, dancing. And we're just sort of just laughing like, what the hell is going on? <laughs> <laughs> I mean, if you cut the review off by this point, that's fine, whatever. Because we're just, I mean, we're just getting it out of our Who system. Cares? Yeah, yeah. I, mean, I so, have to. I have to. Yeah, this is therapy <laughs> for us. There. Yeah, we we're, we're treating each other right now. So, <laughs> all right. So yeah, I mean, yeah, people, we're, we're done. I mean, what can we say? Yeah. Stay, stay away from this shit. I mean, really, yeah. people, we we can't tell you what to do, and and it's all a matter I, I, of yeah. opinion. But I feel, I feel like we might as well be talking to the wall right now. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You know I mean, but didn't hey, we yeah. didn't we try at least the last two times? Uh, I know you guys did. I did it with Epic movie i did that one by myself and then i i did the last one with carlisle and now and and, and now I'm, I'm here with you and this is like, yeah we're sitting here going with, going through a with withdrawal right now we're seeing <laughs> like babies yeah on the ceilings right now laughing at us <laughs> fucking yep. watching that movie oh man yeah i'm just i'm I, i'm really I, I and people i've always told you i do not I, when it comes to movies i really don't take them that seriously no i mean when if you don't like something i mean i might for the sake of a recording, like play it up yeah. and say, "Hey, I, I don't, I hate this movie." And then after yeah. you'll, you'll talk to me, and I'll be like, "I don't care, man. Yeah. You like it? That's fine." Whatever. You know, honestly, like, like, like harping on this movie is almost like you know, it, it's almost as bad as is laughing at somebody in a wheelchair. I mean, <laughs> it's just come on. I mean, come on, really. I mean, I just, I mean, I'm just saying though. It's like if there was one thing that I, if there was one movie that I would actually say, don't help fuel the success of this it, it would be this oh yeah i mean because it just doesn't even yeah. try but it's, it's and, it, and it's and it's almost too easy to 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 make fun of this damn movie and you just you know it's i almost want to tell somebody you know i, I knew it was bad so but why did i need you to tell me that yeah exactly <laughs> i mean i don't know what to do anymore i mean if you see it you see it oh, what, what can we do but but hey we did yeah. it for you guys God oh yeah damn it i know yeah, you should think i'm sure we're both going to kill each other at the end of this whole fiasco, whatever this is. I'm already dead after this. <laughs> I feel like an empty shell of a robot. <laughs>